Welcome back to the Absolato channel. Today we are going to be VOD reviewing my full run through of the Mayhem Round 2 $2,000 cup with my trio Chief and Movability. Hope you enjoy. So our drop spot for this cash cup was the Ski Mountain and it ended up working out pretty well for us in this first game as you'll see. We stacked up together. This team decided that even though they had, you know, probably better loot than us, that they should split up when they decided to attack us, which kind of was their first mistake, as you'll see. Overall, we were really confident going into this cup. We had been practicing all morning, um, preparing for this tournament specifically, and we thought that we did really well yesterday, so... Um, we were really, really excited for it. Right here, uh, I spotted that this team was nading, and I ended up calling it out perfectly. Uh, just as they were throwing it out, so we were able to back up and survive, which was pretty awesome. That's fine. So we were super happy with that. And getting into end game, we, we ended up, you know, dying because one, we didn't have enough mats, and two, we weren't all together the entire time. As you can see, I got beamed right there. And by the time that that happened, the storm was catching up, and Chief was already down, and it was really just to me and John to try and make a move. So I tried to make a last-minute play with some stinks. Um, I realized I probably could have done that earlier. Come on, follow me up. If I decided to use those, me and John could have pushed the team. But as we kept rotating right here, I do realize that I could have threw threw some builds behind me. My pepper ended up did running out, and right here, that wall right there. If it was just planted one second later behind me, we would have been no, fine. Bro. But I think overall, first game, we could have just improved our awareness. Watch right your there. back, watch your back. So, Whole trio. Going into game two, we were a little bit more prepared than the first game. We had together, more mats, stay together, stay together. we had some better guns, oh. and definitely some extra shield. As you can see, I had five minis right here. I almost died. But me getting caught in the storm right there was the main reason why I ended up dying. I thought this guy was gonna die from shaking me down, but he didn't, which I thought was kind of stupid, so. He stayed alive, and John was able to finesse his way by himself. I feel like a lot of these games, he was left on his own, which is the main reason that uh, we didn't do as well as we did yesterday. So, I would say, uh, the one thing that held us back in this game specifically was Chief and I not staying alive during endgame. John almost made a play right here. As you can see, should have killed him. Attack just didn't do enough damage. So, me and Chief just had to stay up. So, third game, we ran out of mats, unfortunately, and we had to try and make a play for them. So, I kind of had to run out into the open without any builds and try and harpoon some. And then I ended up getting costed for it. And John ended up getting movability. Bro, sorry, get getting uh, ended get up getting get costed for it too. But as you can up. see, he fell down into this metal. He was able to survive, and him and Chief were able to make it out of here and uh, keep the game going, which is pretty incredible that they fell down all the way to ground level underneath all this metal, perfectly protected. So I didn't really have a chance. We we had to make a move for the mats because it was the only chance that we were really gonna get. So, I'm gonna come to you actually. Okay, we'll go all this way. Let's see here. It's free. I have a or no, I don't. We John pulls out, out the double, double the double pad, pad me, which was the move. He's so lucky oh God, he didn't get charged right here. But another thing I learned is to just hug the builds like that. See how you hug it though? It That's does like really well. It does really well. So John gets hit again. As he's trying to come in here, and then the stinks, unfortunately, is what finishes us off. So. Chief and John, movability, split up, and ultimately that was what cost us. So game four, we got really screwed. We have our render distance all the way up, and we went for the uh, boat. For those who don't know, the boat has a bunch of heals and good guns and stuff. It's a great way to start your match, and we thought we were uncontested going for it, and then last second, a trio swooped in and took it from us. So we were forced away from our drop spot. And we didn't have any loot, and it was just shambles. We could wait for a, uh, so unfortunately, that's how that one went out. And then moving on to game to five, right I was feeling a little bit more confident, and then I ended up getting naded. Be ready to fight. I got triple naded right on my head, 
didn't even have a chance. And and right here, on me, on me. Wait, wait. Chief and Movability tried to make a move. We didn't have any more mats. Nice they had to make a move we for Storm. So, unfortunately, time. game six did not record correctly, so I'm not able to upload it. Rip and chat. <laughs> but overall, I think that our main things we need to focus on as a trio are our awareness, staying together end game, and our in-game fights. Preferably in the early to mid game, so we can try and get some extra surge tags and prevent, you know, dying in the future. So... We had a lot of fun today. We're going to learn. We're going to keep learning. And we're going to crush it. I appreciate you all watching. Thank you all so much. And I'll see you on the next video. Absolato out.